Boys and girls and ladies and gentlemen and all the things and the people and the guns. We're going to try this, uh, this blue-red double draw deck where you draw two cards. We got Dreadhorde Arcanist that can hit all of these things. And that's pretty much it. Or you can plus him and he can hit Lava Coils and Thrill of Possibility. That's a nice little, that's a nice little combination. Uh, Improbable Alliance and uh, Iron Crag Pyromancer are your payoffs for drawing two cards per turn. Things that help you do that are Cavalier, Kazmina, Royal Scion, Thrill, Opt, Dreadhorde Arcanist, hitting those cards. And then you have uh, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20, 20, 20, 20, 24 lands. Basic, your basic 24 lands. For the sideboard, you have three Aether Gusts, three Negate, four Fry, three Mystical Dispute, and uh, Narset and Flame Sweep. So that seems fine. I'm a fan of it. Let's see if we can have better luck than the previous standard deck we played, which was this blue-black nonsense. Not a fan. Not a fan. I did not enjoy it. Um, I'll keep it. We're looking for, looking for one drops, or uh, lands rather. Do it, you were hovering over this deck. Well, we did it. We did it. Okay. Untap land. No, nope, you can go. Untap land, untap land, untap land. Double improbable alliance seems pretty solid. If it's an untap land, we can go improbable alliance. Next turn, tap land, improbable alliance. And then I don't think our opponents can ever win, even if they even if they try to win. Oh, it's an arboreal grazer. Okay, no, that is not an untapped land, unfortunately. Still not an untapped land. Okay, so we've seen put two cards on the bottom. So we have seen 11 cards and two lands. This isn't a fight you can win. Oh, I've done the hero thing. Shut up and take my money. Oh, am I taking some of my? Hello, it's it's the Kane from Alistair Kane here. Just want to say what a joy it is to support you. Wow, really appreciate that, buddy. Thank you for being for being you. I really appreciate you. I really should have seen that coming. You should have, you stupid idiot. <laughs> Got him. Okay. Alistair Kane. Ah, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate you. You are the hero. Please ban this card. It's just too good, man. Oh dear. Hmm. Hmm. Fascinating. I wish I could play both of these. Maybe we just play this. Try to hit a land. Dude, we hit a land. It was great. Alright, so next turn we can go Alliance, Trigger, Shock, or Arcanist. Oh god. Strange and magnificent world. 
Uh, does this have trample? Vigilance and hate? No, okay. Cover my back, Roman! It's not poison. There's no way to deal. I can't I can't deal with a seven and a six loyalty planeswalker right now. And they're gonna have another six power on the board next turn. Like This is standard. Like you just can't deal with these things. It's like it, these I, I don't even know how to express like how, how much these stifle um, creativity and, and deck brewing and, and things like that. Like Well, you can't trade. You can only exchange creatures. They can't take my walker. That would be insane. Let us plan for the trials ahead. Is this each turn? We draw our second card each turn. Oh, so next turn we can thrill during their turn? That seems actually pretty decent. Wow, if you could if you could exchange an artifact for like a you can exchange a food token for a planeswalker, that seems nuts. I'm just gonna hydroid crash this for seven hundred thousand damage. Guys, it's only ten mana. Guys, it's only twelve mana. The land shall conquer you. This is where they're clicking the clicking the ten icon and uh, the hydroid crisis, which happens to be the last card in their hand conveniently. Yep. Never fails. Noah is going to make this food a creature. Of course he is. Why wouldn't you? Gaze into my face and put on your true shape. I mean, I don't even know how this deck deals with the Hydro process. Roman, help! Well, that's not gonna do it. Five, five. This guy's a ten, ten. Seems good. So we can actually play in Promo Lines. We get three. But then we have no way to like get him back next turn. Of light and the cold truth. Put two cards back. So next time we can go alliance, alliance, draw, make four guys. I mean, that's. Your new look is enchanting. Sure. Oh, we actually have no way to draw now because they're just gonna kill. Like this, this is, this is cringy. Dreadhor Arcanus, Shock and Dreadhor Arcanus just seem miserable here. Negates and Mystical Disputes seem like where you want to be. God, Shock was just terrible.
There's also the explosion. Well, don't do that. Was there stroke in the sideboard? Wow. Okay. Sure. I mean, we are going to use one of these ops, even though Improbable Alliance is great. Red man out of that come jeez. Alliance into Kazmina seems fine. Not nearly as impressive as uh, some other options, but... Personality. Let's play this thing. Let's just go castle. I'm certain you're quite charmed to meet me. I fucking promise you I'm not charmed to meet you. I promise you. I'm already tired of this card and it's been like a week. A literal week in standard and this card is already hot trash. That's amazing to me. It's us or them. I hope you choose the right side. Weird flex, but okay. Oko no Joko. This card is just, God, it's just like, come on, dude. It's unbelievably good. You're like, take a seat. Why would you play any other color but green right now? This literally, dude, it gets past all my creatures, it kills my Kazmina, and it deals me four. Seek out others, then. Come on, man. On the bright side, guys, I get to put Oko down to five. What is my strategy here? Ooh, I feel so alive. 
I bet you do. Like, if you don't have a card like Prison Realm or Assassin's Trophy or like. Assassin's Trophy. You just can't get rid of it. You just have to accept the fact that this dude is on the board, right? Murderous Rider, like Assassin's Trophy, and like Prison Realm are like the three hard, hard answers that you can have for this guy. Like he goes, it, it goes up too fast for you to like attack. He's making creatures essentially, so you can't deal with him that way. I just have no idea. Let's broaden your existence. Mm, a quest of mystery. I hold this one back? I don't even know. Do I want to trade here? Sure. That's yeah, fine. Track you, Seth, with haste. Solid. Solid. But then, don't forget, if Oko's at eight, then your Drac you, Seth, can't kill him. Uh, and then they get to turn it into a three-three next turn. Well, okay, he's, he's at seven. I've been attacking him for two turns, and he's still at seven doing things. Oh, God. Do you ever see a card in Magic where you're like, this is a mistake? Synthesize the facts. This is ridiculous. I can't deal with either of these things, and I have like no way to attack their their life total. The only thing keeping me alive here is the fact that they have like three lands, four lands, but now they can make like. Do not underestimate my fortitude. It's just ridiculous. Yep. So the goose makes a food, Oka makes a 3 3. Goose makes a food, Oka. Like, I can't. I, it's just not even fun. I don't understand why anyone would not play non green decks, like with, with like four of all of these idiots. Four questing beast, four, uh, four Nissas, four Oka. Put them all in your deck. Just four Hydroid Crassus. Like. Those are the four best cards in standard, right? Yeah, when that spirally banana comes at you, you better watch it. Seven, eight, nine. It's not poison. Trust me. I guess field is it is in there somewhere. Yeah, it's like Oko, Nissa, Hydroid Crassus, Questing Beast, Field of the Dead. You're like, okay, cool. Yep. Draw four. Totally, totally fair. Totally fair. Fair and balanced magic card. God, I invested in a bunch of standard cards, but like... I don't even... I, it's like I'm, I'm at a point where I'm like, I wish I didn't have all these standard cards. This deck, however, does not seem like... like You're just playing these underwhelming strategies. Like, improbable, an improbable alliance deck with the Royal Science seems super fun. Like, this could be a really fun archetype in a standard format that doesn't have all this bullshit. 
Uh, yeah, we can. Yeah, that's not going to do anything. Unless they're literally tapping out for Hydroid Crassus. Like, it's just not going to do anything. Oh, I would have loved that, but alas. I can help you no longer. Okay, well, guess we're in a Yeah, we're not technically dead yet. Really? You don't Welcome steal my Iron Crag Pyromancer? Feast. I guess they don't... I mean, they don't have ways to make... to draw extra cards consistently, so... Training? I... I'm dead inside, does that count? Personality. You know what? Sure. I'll keep it. No, the deck rarely. I don't think we've cast. I don't think we cast three spells in any one turn. You're not playing cheap spells. You're just playing spells that happen to draw you cards. When did Forest become the best card in Magic the Gathering? That's that's the hard questions I want to ask myself. Ask other people. Well, these are those are friggin' nice lands. Look at these beauties. God, all, all everybody has cool lands, and I just feel like I didn't play during a specific period of time because I was over here supporting Wizards of the Coast's Magic Online with cube drafts. I didn't get these sweet lands. That's unfortunate. Oh god, this deck is hot trash. This deck is garbage. <laughs> no attacks. <laughs> oh good lord, man. Does this deck do anything? How do I deal with this? How does a red blue deck deal with this guy? Oh, you get Iron Crag Pyromancer down, and then you draw a second card, deal it three. Then you go to the next turn, draw a second card, deal another three, and that's six six damage. You just have to convince Magic the Gathering uh, to not um, 
to not remove the damage after the first turn. But if you can do that, you're probably in good shape. So, you know, that's, you got that going for you. I, there's like no way to win. Like you don't have any way to win these games. These decks we've played today have been uh, La Poo Poo. That's the Poo Poo. I need the pain, but my brother. Let me synthesize the facts. Uh, yeah, synthesize the facts. You stupid idiot. Ugh. So it's just when he attacks? Yeah, alright. I just don't even know how, like, I don't even know how this deck... I don't know how this deck does anything. Like, take my money. So sad, dude. Hey all, Mr. Peanut here. Just wanted to remind you to eat my Mr. Peanut brand peanuts. I have the best prices. Want to know how? The other peanuts trust me because I'm also a peanut. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, I mean that's good. That's that's good. That's a good thing. Good good peanut. Good way to go. Way to be a peanut. Hey, do any of these cards in the sideboard deal with Rotting Regisaur? Mm, I don't think so. Do any of these cards in the main deck deal with Rotting Regisaur? Mm, I don't think so. Okay, well. Guess that'll do. I guess Mystical Dispute does if we uh, manage to... I guess Shock seems... Oh god, Shock seems so bad. Shock seems so bad. It's so bad, guys. It's so bad. <sighs> Dreadhold Arcan is also just terrible. I mean, we can't target Shifting Ceratops with Gust. We can't top target Rotting Registrar with Gust. Like, it's not good. But, Larry David. Larry David Toblerone. Wow. You sure. It does work on Ceratops? Oh, because you can counter it. Sure, but like, well, it's got Pro Blue, though. I mean, like, so, I mean, like, if it's on board, it does. It doesn't. But if it's, if you're just countering it and putting it on top for a turn. Free ops and shocks. <laughs> yeah, think of the free ops. You're like, oh, I'm going to opt. Oh, I died. Oh, Jesus, how greedy do I get here? I don't care about a mountain. You know anything about this deck? Not great, Bob. That guy had to go. Nothing? Yeah, Scions Walk or Royal Arcanist. So if I have an Arcanist on board and a Royal Scions, and I live long enough to cast something that costs two mana for my graveyard, it's pos it's 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 sweet. The problem is Roger running Registor just don't give a fuck about plus two on this guy and, and recasting a lava coil from my graveyard. And they don't have a 3-4, right. If they don't have any 4-toughness creatures, then... Oh, here's one. Here, look, we found a 4-toughness creature. But I get a free shock out of it. Just kidding. That was just a joke. I was just kidding, guys. We don't get a free shock out of it. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. That's good. I mean, we take four, but still good. Why are these swamps together in these forests not? Because you play this this turn? So this one has summoning sickness? Is it 4-5? Oh, I didn't. Nope, I didn't. I literally pulled it back. I was just going to play this, but I guess, I guess we're not. It doesn't matter. Guys, I've given up all, all will to live in the, in the game of Magic the Gathering. Just play your other questing beast and call it a day. Jesus. That's a big dude. That is a big, dirtily dude. This Cavalier is just terrible. Put two cards back. Uh, we're definitely gonna play a land. I'll put you and you back. I mean, the nice thing about Improbable Alliance is that it can at least... Yeah, I'm not gonna not get a land here. It can at least make blockers for Registar. Uh, drag cards, put them bottom, and we'll just... Do we, do we even want a second Royal Scions? Probably not. Sixty minute ham. So one, two, three, one, two... Oh god, he's just gonna fall. Why would you play that first in case you get like... I mean, like, that's weird because you could literally play that pre-combat, try to hit a questing beast, and then attack for, I don't know, a thousand. Oh dear god. I think we got this, guys. There's no way they can actually kill us here. Oh, they can kill Royal Scions because they can pump their one drop? Got it. Got it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so they... Okay, this is a gift. Stay away from my brother. Can I get one of them? Swoop, swoop, swoops. Um, I keep one. I guess we'll keep dispute. That doesn't seem great. I mean, like. We can just play in Probable Alliance, right? Embrace your fear and oh, it's until end of turn. I thought it would be until your next turn. What a dumb idiot. What an actual dumb idiot. I guess it doesn't matter. I mean, we're not going to plus... It doesn't matter because we're not going to plus it the other way. Are they all face? Oh, God. Um, so, oh, God. Uh, so, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This guy can almost kill us. But it, it, it requires them to use all of their mana, so... All right, so we're going to one here, which is maybe not terrible, because now they can't do anything this turn. We get to go opt and... Oh. oh, this was terrible. I should have... Oh, no, because we would have had to discard the opt. No, we would have discarded this. 
And then we could have opted on their turn rate two guys. Uh, we can still activate, I guess. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that's actually even better. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can't actually we can't actually cast this. Uh, never mind. That's dumb. Ooh, a quest of mystery. Okay. Uh one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, sure. We're actually gonna attack because they need two removal spells to get rid of these guys. Using opt on their turn doesn't do anything. You yeah, that's what you're right. That's actually only uh, neither does actually using this. So I actually think we're dead here. Um, <laughs> oh god, that's so confusing. Cause I'm like, wait, this lets us draw. Cause I'm in my, I'm in the mode where I'm like, this draws us a second card. So yeah, that's yeah. There's really nothing we could do there. I don't think we'd have to just triple block. One, two... Oh, well, so yeah, opt... If we opted and we Improbable Alliance next turn, that would have done it. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Yeah, I'm aware it's each turn, man. I know that. I mean, we're literally taking advantage of each turn last game. Come on, herbivores, get it together. Sixty minute man. I think this deck would actually be pretty sweet if it could win games. I think this deck, once you win games with this deck, it actually it seems pretty good. Unfortunately, though, ooh, um, I don't think that's a real thing. God, if I have to see another Temple of Mystery or Once Upon a Time again. Well, I got some news for you. Okay, I'll keep that. Well, I'm playing this deck for videos, man. I can't just stop playing it, like... Like mid play. It's just that every other green deck just has so much better. Like, if they just play Questing Beast here, we're just like. Oh, okay. I can't deal with that. Oh, God. Walk with me. Sing with me. I will enlighten you. One by one. And all your cares are gone. I don't know what to tune it up with, though. That's the thing. Hold on. We'll figure this out. Hold on. We can do this. We can beat this Oko. We can't fucking beat this Oko. Shock it. Attack it. Shock it again. Like you can play this, they just make it a 3-3, or they just exchange it. Oh, I'm sorry, Magic. I didn't know I was taking too long. I mean, they could turn this into a 3-3 and attack signs back for 5. Thank you. Oh, 
John Travolta, thank you so much for the resub, stopping in from YouTube land to resubscribe. Keep up the great work being been checking out the friends podcast. Loving it so much. Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. <laughs> Surely you see the humor here. So is standard just every deck plays Oko into Nissa, and then there's like nothing you can do? Is that just the whole format? Is that the whole miserable fucking format? It sure seems like that, doesn't it? Blah, 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 blah. Like, what's the point? What's the, I can't deal with both of these. I have shocks in my fucking hand. I have an O4 that deals that does nothing. Oh god. I'm sorry, guys. This is torturous. Oh, God. It's so bad. It's so bad. These past two decks we played have been very, very bad. No offense to, to anyone. On YouTube, I don't think this one will do well for you. I think it's fine. I think people... I, I don't think people just... I don't think people only want to see decks that win, though. That's the thing. Like... And I think it's... I'm, I'm actually being comical about it, I hope. But, like... Oh, man. I'm just... I'm, like... I think I'm almost, like... Quite flabbergasted. Also, I put enough content on YouTube that I don't need to worry about like a single video that doesn't do well because I'm putting if I'm putting two videos out a day, I can't only play the really good ones. Like that seems. <sighs> play Boros Reckoner. Okay. As a control deck where I'm like, ooh, I can keep up Mystical Dispute and Thrill, I'm like, cool. AMTG? What does that mean? <laughs> oh. I thought it was a Magic the Gathering, and I was like, what does that even mean? Yeah, it's like Bolt the Bird, Murder the Goose. Discard this thing. Are they going to counter my thrill of possibility? I'll negate it. I mean, it's a good value if they do. Okay, they didn't. Sixty minute man. No, I just don't, like, no. Right? Can I... Can I... Oh, yeah, alright, there we go. Um... It doesn't do anything. I get a free Lava Coil or a free Thrill of Possibility, like... And, wait, no, not even. I'd have to pump this guy, otherwise he does nothing. Dalkyrie, what's going on, my dude? Like, if this guy doesn't get pumped, like, he's just a 1-3. Oh, you could free a 1-free opt. Yeah, that's not worth it. Let's broaden your existence. Hold steady 
your mind, Rowan. And I will enjoy I enjoy the proper application of knowledge. Oh god. I have made a tactical error. It's not poison. Trust me. Sometimes it's not worth getting in the chair, guys. Oh, Jesus. There is no virtue without bravery. If only this had haste. Okay, you got it. Gaze into my face and put on your true shape. Like, the fact that, the fact that, like, I'm like, well, they just turned my previous guy into a 3-3, so there's no way they can do it to my next guy. But I'm like, wait, no, they can, because that's a plus one ability. You want some cake? <laughs> Buddy, I don't even know. Bravery galvanizes any plan. Oh look, they turned this guy into a 3-3 as well, oh, and now dear. Oko is up to 9. Oh, and you're gonna fight my guy. Yeah, okay. I, mm, yeah, okay. Well. See you later. We haven't won a game with this deck, and I have no idea even how to. Sixty minute man. <sighs> uh. 
Right, none of the draw cards are actually netting you cards, right? Like, it's literally loot, 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 loot. Uh, so I'm looking up counter because I want to see like if there's any kind of counter spell that would also let us draw a card. I don't think so though. Brainstorm does net you a card. Wow. What about Niv-Mizzet? Why don't we just play Niv-Mizzet instead of Cavalier of Gales? Also, why do we only have one Castle of Antris? What's Fairy Formation? I don't even know what the shit that is. Do I even have that card? Fairy formation? What the? What is this shit? Yeah, but this is like... This is like some Planeswalker deck intro nonsense, right? Okay, that's a bra Oh, that's a Brawl deck card. Yeah. I mean, like... It's probably not terrible. But it could be terrible. I'm gonna wait. No, don't craft that. I already have a million. No, don't put that in there. Put another one of these in there. Get one of these out of here. Draw. I'm just gonna look. Look. I'm just gonna look up draw. Proliferate. Draw a card. Like this almost seems better than. Like a lot of things we have: Royal Scions, Fairy Vandal, which we just added, Kazmina. and is it? Instant or sorcery? Sorcery is rough. What if we get teamer with Risen? Well, the th Risen Reef's not drawing you a card, right? You're revealing it and you either put it in your hand or. What about Fibble Thip? Dude, even Fibble Thip in this deck feels better than Dreadhorde Arcanist. Yeah, Risen Reef's not drawing you the card, unfortunately. How many games have we lost now? Uh, how many have we played? That's the number. It's the same number. Games we've played, games we've lost. Corporate needs you to find the difference between these two pictures. It's the same picture. I think eight, maybe five, six. <laughs> oh, Jesus, God. Okay, these cards are, are must-haves. How many lands are in this deck? Like 24? Okay. A reasonable amount. Thrill doesn't excite me because I don't want my card... It, my, I don't want my card draw to... It's, it's actually fine, I guess. Shock feels bad. Take out one Cavalier of Gales. Take out the Shocks. I just think the Shocks aren't that good. I think you mean it doesn't thrill you. That's, yeah, that's actually more accurate. Oh, uh, eh, eh. So opt is gonna return thrills good. I like another Kazmina. I also like another coil. And then we have one more slot. We 
We have one slot here. Is it just fourth Kazmina? I like Kazmina a lot. I feel like I want a card that just gives me things, though. Maybe we want one shot. I think, like, I think Shock is pretty trash. Yeah, save the changes. I, I want to open, I want to open whatever pack this is so I can get my 20 jimmies. There we go. Good for me. Okay, we're gonna... I want to take out one Fry and add one more Negate. Negate seems way more relevant than Fry. I mean, Commence seems fine. Op don't impress me much. Uh, uh, uh. What about one Fibblethip? I like one Fibblethip. Draws you a second card. All right, let's try this instead. I think the two Niv Mizzets give us a better. I don't like wishing well because I don't want to pay four to to draw to draw two at some point. So we can Oath into it? Yeah, you want to go... Uh, I don't think Oath of Druids is legal in Legacy, right? Because that seems broken. Oh god, Oko can just literally target... <laughs> can't can literally target a... Jesus. It can target N Niv Mizzet and just make it a 3-3. Three -three. Okay, well, two of these guys, a little more problematic than one of these. Oh, don't play that. Guys, if we had shocks right now, can you even imagine? Is there a red mana three damage to everything, or is there just like two damage to everything? Because I could really go for a 3 damage to everything. I'm going to be honest, I'm pretty sure there's not 4. Iron Crag Pyromancers in the deck. No, that's not... That, yeah, Clarion's not red though, it's red-white. That's the only one I can think of too. I'm not sure if there's just a mono-red one that I can play. I just have nothing to do. I So here's my problem, and you guys have been witnessing this this whole time. This deck doesn't do anything. If this deck was flavor text, it would be the Null Rod flavor text. Vampirism is a useful trait. Ooh, two more lands. Hey, it's Iron Craig Pyro Mansadio. Oh god, please don't play that. God, please don't draw another land. Please kill this guy. Okay, alright, now we got a thing going. Okay, sounds like you need Kiki Exarch. No beats, what's going on? 
Oh, that's that's good. Our creature died after one turn. Well, what can you do? Magic is hard. I don't know what's happening right now. Oh, God. We just make a 2 2. That doesn't seem great. Listen up. My students are loyal geniuses. Got it. Joke's on you, buddy. I got a 2 2. The dream is dying. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Not great, Bob. What are we at? Eight? We got this. What are we at? What are we at? Seven? Six? We got this. What are we at five? We got this. Oh, you went there. What are we at six? I told you we got this. Guys, you want to see a pro gamer move? None of these cards do anything. <laughs> God. Oh, God. It's so painful. We are the future. Eating some Cheez Its and watching my man. Have you played Modern against a deck that runs that blue castle and a couple of cryptic commands? Yes, we actually just played it the other day. And it was not, not good. You might say it was bad. I'll get rid of a castle, and we're going to do one of these jobbies to this gentleman. We're at three, so we can block here, and then we're dead. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. We tried. We had a good run. Okay, so uh, let's bring in Flame Sweep and hope their guys are all small enough that that makes a difference. I don't think Fry is good. Mm, don't think Negate's good. Um, I'm gonna take Thrill and a, and an Opt Out. This was a deck. This deck was another five zero. Yes. Yeah. Oh, is it got to be 60 cards? Man, 60 cards. They ask so much of me. What did I take out? I took out a Royal Scions accidentally. I will play first. Okay. The deck is, I mean, it's like painfully bad and I don't understand it. I'm trying to like, I'm trying to like give it the bend. I'm trying to like figure out like, am I missing it? Maybe you are supposed to aggressively mulligan, but even so like, if you have to aggressively mulligan for Alliance, then you also have to have cards, multiple cards that draw you a second card each turn. And like, sometimes I have, I have like a one in my hand. Okay. I want a blue source so I can go Fairy Vandal off. I'll just play that instead. I hope they don't kill it. Don't have Murderous Rider in your hand. Why did he say it like that? You know what? I don't know, guys. But, 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 do, 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 do. Oh, that's what we're talking about. V -v -v Vandal. I 
I'm gonna bottom that. Even though it lets us play Cavalier, I think it's fine without it. Kill that. Get a cap. See, now this is what we want. Are we going to ha Wait, are we doing things? We're doing it. We're living the dream right now. Or, you know, trying to, I guess. Check it in there. No, I guess I guess not. I like I like sending a message as much as the next guy, but not today. Hmm. We don't even get to draw a card from that. Come on. How do they know that? What's that about, man? I guess the I guess that's the only real creature they could have hit, so that doesn't that doesn't really indicate anything, I guess. Look how good we are. Look how good this deck is. Guys, this deck is unbeatable. I'll sack it and make a food. That is your right. <laughs> I drew a card! Yeah, that's my... Yeah, that's how I feel. Will this take benefit from the goblin that adds 1-1 one, one counters to non-creatures? Uh, Grumgully? I mean, like, it would benefit from that. Like, if we're adding green, then we're just going to be like, put in Oko. Put in Grum... Like, you know. I really don't... I'm going to opt instead so I don't draw this, this mountain. Would this be better if it was like draw three cards, put two on top or bottom of your library in any order? Like, I feel like that would be still fine. Like, it seems to be better, right? Like, but having to draw the two cards, like you're just you're just brainstorm locking yourself essentially. Ben, I appreciate it, buddy. Don't get me wrong. Don't you dare get me wrong, buddy. Oh, look, it's a kitty cat. Make a food, sack of food. Hmm. Well, that is unfortunate. It's okay, we have a card to discard, we have creatures to sacrifice. Essentially okay. This is not how this deck looked in game one. Oh, we could also just block, too. I guess that's also an option. Man, Fibbletop is just waiting to draw us that second card. Hmm. Kazmina, also not bad. I don't want to play the Steam Vents in case they end up getting through, I guess, with Rankle. I don't think that's a thing. Any fun news? Not that I know of. I don't think they're going to get through with Rankle, but they could play Legion's End on these guys, and then we're forced to block with this. That doesn't seem fun, so... I just don't feel like... When we have Kazmina in hand, I don't feel like it's necessary to toss the Steam Vents out there. Any not fun news? No, no news Any no news in general, really.
Any boring news? No. My man, my man's is my man's is just looking for some news. I hear you, buddy. Oh, sup, Alan? Is there a debate tonight? Did they just miscast Murderous Rider and then concede? That's the second time someone has accidentally cast Murderous Rider as a creature and not as a instant. Uh, if you just opened Oko in a pack on Arena, you definitely uh, do not have to play him. I was going to say yes, but then I realized no. No, don't. I would advise against it. Oh, I wish I had time to watch. I wish you had time to hang out more. Have you considered getting rid of your kids so that we can hang out more? Our friendship died when you decided to have kids, Rob. <laughs> Unbelievably selfish. I'm going to keep this. And I'm going to hope we draw a third and we're going to go this guy into this guy. And God, I just want to win one, just one match. Just give me this one match. Papa needs a Papa needs a match win. Then he can close out the books. Sadly, hanging with you isn't tax deduction. What if we talk about your job? And then we're like, hey man, Rob's job, 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 job. And then tax deduction. Can we draw an op next turn? That'd be sick. Hmm. Whoa! So next turn we're gonna play this, and then if God willing, we draw another land, we can play improbable lines, fill it up on the same turn. Trigger this, 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 trigger this. Robsjobs.com. I don't know if that's a link. Don't click on that. That could be pornography. That is not a safe link. Uh, yeah, it says potential risk ahead. I'm like, mm, I'm out. You gotta draw the line somewhere, my dude. Yeah, I don't know why you're talking to Pernicious, dude. That was definitely standard beat. Oof. I think we're just passing here. Like, if we can get double improbable alliance next turn. Like we want to do. Or we just play Scions, actually. Let's play Scions. No attacks. We want to hit a land here, so let's play Scions. Pump it up. Is the greatest. With the courage and then we get a free... Fire. We get to shoot this Corpse Knight. My answers lie in the Discard a card. <sighs> Do we discard Niv? I think we can discard Flame Sweep, actually, because we're getting rid of both of these dudes.
We'll all be. So we can we can just go alliance alliance. Oh god, this is just. This is the end, my only friend of the end. This is it. My plan is crystallizing. There are two castle. There's. You're asking if Castle Embereth is in here? No, no, there's not. Maybe there should be one though, because you're making all these fairies, right? Oh uh, no, text. It seems very good. So does Lightning Bolt every turn. This one Fibble Tip, man, it was the best addition to the deck. This guy also pretty good. Teleportal does seem good. You ain't kitten. Yep, I'm just gonna keep killing these creatures. Look at all our triggers. They got a lot of food though, guys. The 2 1 flying cantrip elemental? Oh, yeah, that, yeah, that sounds fair. Nope, that's an old one. Oh, God. It was so hard to tell. Strike fear into the hearts of the wicked. I'm going to oops them. They know what I did. Man, that's life. Sad. I've been playing this archetype a bit. Sorry to hear it, buddy. Sorry to hear it. I've been running a similar deck, and I have a, I have the Calvacades or whatever they are in there. And they're, oh, that sounds decent too. I think you do want some way to pump these guys up because otherwise they're just they're just bad. Oh snap. This is the first match we're even close to winning. And I think it's because we took out the shitty Dreadhorde Arcanist that doesn't do anything. And we took out a bunch of shocks that really don't do anything. Arclight, see, Arclight Phoenix is interesting because we have no, there's, there's never been a turn except for maybe like, maybe last turn. No, even then we only played these two. There's never been a turn where we've actually had, um, three spells cast on any given turn. So, I mean, I'm, uh, these, the list sounds like they're probably pretty different. One, two, three, four, five... You know what? I will keep that guy. Lady, with me, I'm smiling. Often their turn doesn't do anything because it's only one card. Like it literally does nothing. This is whenever you draw your second card. These are all whenever you draw your second card. Opt will be the first card we draw during their turn. Whereas like on our turn, Opt is the second card we have drawn. You get it. You figured it out. I'm not going to ignore you because you've said some great stuff and you got a Founder's Badge. I can't... I could never ignore you. What's the new Red Instant thing? you got to be a little more specific than that. <laughs> they're just, we're still at... They're at 16 and we're at 12. Like, we're still behind, which is ironic. You know... <laughs> 
No, dude. I don't. How do you draw a card deals one damage whenever a player casts an instant sorcery against a king cat? This means do we just go? Do we just have a turn? No, I'm just gonna play this guy. Trigger, 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 trigger. Um, let's put back land and niv visit. That's fine. Uh, eventually we will. I just want to get all the cards that actually have cascading effects off the board. Like, if it's like, whenever this happens, whenever this happens, I just want to get those off the board first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're gonna draw this guy. All attacks. Yeah, seems fine. <laughs> this is, yeah, let's get in there. All right, I think we got this. Oh my God, guys, a win. A win, a win, a win. I hope you guys stuck with this video. Check me out on patreon.com slash Frank Lepore. One or two dollars a month is a great way to support the channel. It's like nothing. It's basically free. You can find that in your pockets. You can also check out CoolStuffInc.com every Wednesday. I have new articles going up. Definitely leave comments on there. Also check me out at Manatraders.com. You can't check me out there, but you can definitely get 20% off the first three months of any subscription if you use the promo code and the link in the description below. This was our final deck list. I think it, I mean like, the evidence is clear. Like we won the second. Maybe the niv are too cute. But I think it's just a strong card. But oh God, the problem is the stupid... It, it, like, we just played a non-green deck and then we beat it. So maybe this is just great years ago. Or I was reading the comment. Uh, maybe this is just great against non-green decks and that's just where you're at. But I have no idea. Either way, eh, it is what it is. Thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate you guys. I'll see you next time. Slam those like and subscribe buttons and uh, I'll see you around.